They hate to see you win. Fuck them, nigga. We ball. Grinding day and night. Praying you never fall. Bitches love to talk shit. Jealousy getting involved. Drinking liquor. Fucking bitches disguising what's going on. Did some self hate shit. Nigga be feeling alone. Looking for someone to call. No one picking up the phone. Trying to stay in your zone with all the shit going on. Devil riding your back telling you to end it all. So you picking up a gun. Put that shit to your brain. Thinking you are in love but mentally is insane. Fuck the glory and the fame. Get that shit through your brain. If you walked in my shoes, nigga wouldn't last a day. Got that pressure on your brain. Slowly fading away. Pulling that shit together, what your strong friends say, but they don't know your pain. And at the end of the day, you pulling the fucking trigger, then the pain goes away. I guess I really don't know what Christmas is all about. Isn't there anyone who knows what Christmas is all about? It's not roasting Black frost nipping at your nose So I'm offering a simple phrase Although it's been said many times, many ways to What's up y'all, it's your girl Nick G the host and today I want to see if this camera is not going to pick up the sound from behind it and over there because it's a lot going on where I'm at. But I want to talk about something real quick. So um, so I want to talk about um, suicide today. So you know I know a lot of people have been wondering like you know what I'm doing, how I'm holding up, what's wrong with me, blah, blah, blah. And, you know, I want y'all to know at one point, and I, this, in this video, I'm going to be very transparent. Um, I was definitely thinking about suicide. And I wrote a song about it, and I actually recorded it, but I didn't get it, um, like, I guess mastered or whatever. It was on a Cardi B beat. But I'm going to just say what the words were, right? This, this video is coming from the heart. Uh, I'm not really gonna edit anything out. Hopefully y'all don't hear the sound coming from both places where I am, but uh, I'm just gonna cancel everything out and focus on y'all in this video. So, um, the words were, they hate to see you win, fuck them nigga, we ball. Grinding day and night, praying you never fall. Bitches love to talk shit, jealousy, getting involved, drinking liquor, fucking bitches, disguising what's going on. Did some self hate shit, nigga be feeling alone, looking for someone to call, no one picking up the phone, trying to stay in your zone with all the shit going on. Devil riding your back, telling you to end it all, so you picking up a gun, put that shit to your brain, thinking you are in love, but mentally is insane. Fuck the glory and the fame, get that shit through your brain if you Walked in my shoes, nigga wouldn't last a day. Got that pressure on your brain, slowly fading away. Pulling that shit together, what your strong friends say, but they don't know your pain. And at the end of the day, you pulling the fucking trigger, then the pain goes away. This is exactly what I was thinking around this time where um, I was going through everything, uh, you know, my, with everything that I was going through. Y'all know what I was going through. <laughs> but anyway... Um, I'm making this video today because I want to let people know that suicide is not the answer. It is on my heart to say these things and I'm going to just let them out fluidly and um, just let you know, you know what I'm saying? Suicide is not the answer and you are definitely loved. And if you are not loved by anyone or you feel like you're not loved by anyone, love yourself, okay? I um, am definitely going through a crazy, crazy transition of just being who I am and appreciating who I am. But in order for me to see that, in order for me to do that, I have to face what I'm doing. I have to face who I am. You get what I'm saying? And a lot of us don't like to face who we are. They don't like to hear bad things about themselves. We, we don't like to... Uh, see ourselves in a bad light we don't like to go through struggles everybody wants to skip the struggle include me 
You know what I'm saying? Right now, I am going through the struggle and I want to skip it. I want this shit to end. Things happen in threes and they've been happening sixes, nines. Every other day is something. You get what I'm saying? And it puts pressure on your brain, you know? And it's like, what what it is, is an obstacle. It's, it's for you to jump over. It's for you to hurdle it. It's for you to overcome whatever it is you're going through. It is not for you to stay there. You get what I'm saying? So... If you don't take nothing from this video, understand this. It's not about anybody else but you. I could always say, you know what I'm saying? Talk to your friends, you know? Um, talk to the people around you. Talk to your mom. Talk to your dad. That shit don't be working. You know what I'm saying? Especially friends. Because when you have people that you think are your friends, they are not. At the end of the day, people are going to do whatever they need to do to help them to make sure they are straight. They look out for them first, right? So if they do that, why can't you? You know what I'm saying? I'm not telling anyone to be selfish. I'm not telling anyone to be a narcissist. I'm not telling anyone to um, not think about others. But what I am saying is put yourself first, okay? Pray to whoever you pray to. Meditate. Uh, work out. You know, uh, take good natural supplements that can give you happiness and allow you to lose weight and get some of this, 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 this anger up off of you, this, this frustration, this, this pain. It's a lot of things that can numb pain. That's not just alcohol. And I was drinking alcohol for a long time. You know what I'm saying? I got some say over there right now that I'm ready to crack open. You get what I'm saying? Um, it's just like, I can't tell you how to go through it. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm going through it. But what I do know is when it comes to suicide, you know, um, and I'm, this is not, this is what is working for me. That doesn't mean it's going to work for you. But to the people who feel this way, it's a lot of people who tell me they feel this way. Don't do it. It's not worth it. Do not do it. I'm coming on this camera telling you that I was thinking about it because I want you to know no one is perfect. Y'all look at, you know, people on the internet as if they're perfect. Hell no. We are probably the most dysfunctional people you'll ever meet. You know what I'm saying? Because we're trying to figure out how to make money, how to, um, how to stay alive. You know what I'm saying? How to, how to not work the, the, the nine to five norm and nine to five norm is structure. You get what I'm saying? It's good to have a nine to five because it gives you structure. It builds what is it called? I don't know. It, it, it You build something in, in the process of uh, structure. You know what I'm saying? It allows you to be obedient. You know, um, it allows you to understand other people. It, it makes you strong because you want to quit. You want to quit, but something is, a, is you can't, you know? And, and these shoes that we walk in, you'll be quitting on yourself. Anybody that does YouTube, I don't care if it's big, small, whatever. You'll be quitting on yourself. You get what I'm saying? And I just cannot do that. You know, I have had some very dysfunctional moments. I have met some people in a in a time where I have been very dysfunctional. I know some people today have been like, yo, that been great. You know what I'm saying? Some of y'all might be thinking the same thing. But I don't care. I told them that. And I'll say the same to you. You know what I'm saying? I don't care. I appreciate these moments because at some point you will be humbled. At some point you will have to change what you're doing. At some point you will have to be better than what you are today. You know what I'm saying? And times like this will make you who you are. Right now, I am building confidence. I am building uh, self-awareness. I am building humility. I am I'm building um I'm learning how to deal with consequences. I'm learning structure. I'm learning how to be a better me on a daily basis. You know what I'm saying? And you know, right now, <laughs> y'all, I don't have no friends. Cause everybody keep asking me like, where, where this person, that person, that person. If you don't see them, they ain't, they ain't here. <laughs> you can keep asking all you want to, you know what I'm saying? Y'all can be talking to yourselves, but they ain't here. They're not here, baby. I just fell out with two more. <laughs> Y'all don't know about. They're not here either. They're not here anymore. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But I'm okay with that. People show their true colors in the, in, in the time of your struggle. You know? Or you just see who they really are. You know what I'm saying? In the time of your struggle. Either way, it's exposed. You see who people really are. You even see who you really are. You know what I'm saying? And at this moment in time, I don't need them. You know? So I'm cool with that. 
the people that I do have in my life, I appreciate you. I'm glad you are here um, and can deal with my dysfunctional ass and my mess. I'm a mess right now, but I'm I'm a I'm I'm a growing mess. I'm getting so much better daily. I, I'm I'm loving myself more and more each day. You know what I'm saying? My skin looks great. I'm smiling more. Like a, I'll be all right. You know what I'm saying? One thing you won't be able to say about me is that I gave up on myself and you won't be able to say I'm not here anymore because I'm not taking my own life. That's the whole point of this video. And I don't know who I made this video for. I don't know who I'm speaking to, but I hope you hear me and I pray that you can, can really get deep inside yourself and see how much you are worth because nobody else is gonna be able to tell you this shit. Nobody. It don't feel good. Anything anybody say, you're beautiful. No, I'm not. You're pretty. No, I'm not. You're smart. No, I'm not. You're going to continue to sell, tell yourself these things that you're not and just nobody can help you, you know? And it's because you're not allowing it or, I mean, maybe, you know, y'all don't vibrate the same. I don't know. It's so much crazy shit going on out here. I can only tell you to appreciate yourself, bro appreciate yourself you are the only person that matters in your life stop trying to please everybody it don't work stop trying to pay everybody bills you're gonna go broke <laughs> stop being mr nice guy you know what i'm saying stop talking so much you're not hearing anything you know i am that person and i had to overcome that because the things that I said in that in that song, that's what I wanted to do. You would think if I just if I just blow my brains at all the end, everything would be gone. If I just cut my wrist, if I just jump off a building. Let me tell you something that humbled me. Somebody sent me a video of somebody jumping off a building. And the man survived, bruh. But his feet were broken, his hands were broken and ribs and everything else, but he was alive. You wanna know why? It wasn't time for him to go. And let me tell you something. You mess around and attempt to do it, and it ain't time for you to go, you are gonna be messed up while you still here. Now that's some reality for your ass, right? We can't run from it. Don't. And I'm saying we. I'm in this with you, okay? You can get through this. I hope this touched somebody today, okay? I'm not doing this for money. Nobody told me to do this. I just really feel deep down inside of my heart. I was listening to that because I wrote it and I meant it. And I, you know, I needed to share this with y'all. You know what I'm saying? And to the people that's feeling this. At this point, I feel like I'm being repetitive. I love y'all so, so damn much. Thank you to the people who do support me. You know what I'm saying? To the people that are not here, they ain't. Get over it. You get what I'm saying? Please. Um, and if you don't, well, do what you got to do. But, um, you know, it's me, baby. It's me. I'm here. You know, take me. Or not. Uh, but, accept you. Love you. Be you. Relentlessly. Unapologetically, baby. Okay? Give me a kiss. And a hug. Mwah. You got this shit. All right. Let it snow.